for ribeye burgers, ribeye and chuck burgers. Now, we kicked these off at midnight last night. And when I say we, I mean it wasn't me, I was sleeping. But Mr. Domeyer was here at midnight. And since that time, we've taken word, uh, orders for over 22,000 sets of burgers. 6,500 in this show. This is Ray Ristelli, everybody. Make him feel welcome. He is a proud father and grandfather of 10, ten grandbabies. 10 grandbabies. And you have to know, and I visited his plant in South New Jersey, he is all about family. Family is number one, comes before his 48 year business. Family is the most important thing to you, and we appreciate that about you, sir. Thank you so much. All right, now, he's also created a burger only for QVC. Now, Mr. Rostelli provides burgers and food to restaurants and to organizations around the world, but these burgers are only made for us. Only for, for QBC, David, and I will tell you, one of the organizations we supply all the food for is the U.S. military, and we oh, could so not great. be prouder of that. <clears throat> so that is fantastic, and I know that those servicemen and women appreciate all that good Rostelli meat coming they their do. way. They do. Hey, this is the burger that you're wanting. That's one burger <laughs> of the 12 or the 24 that you're ordering today. These burgers actually plump when you cook them. This is not a burger that's going to shrink. Now, this sauce is Poppy's sauce. Who is Poppy? That would be Ray Rostelli. That's me. He has 10 grandbabies at home. They all call him Poppy. And so he used to make this mayonnaise based sauce from scratch, and it was your grandchildren that told you you should, you it, should offer it. Exactly. My, my oldest granddaughter, Ellie, she said, Pop. You really need to. Actually, there's a picture of my grandbabies. Um, that's, <laughs> you know, they are, they are wannabe chefs. Um, I love it. But, all of their but outfits. It's all about food, all right? I mean, food brings us around the table. It brings us it brings us together as a family. And food should be fun. So when we start creating sauces like this, and Ellie said, "Poppy, you really should bring that to QVC." We thought, "Let's go ahead and do that." And it's been just well, wildly Mr. successful. Well, Mr. Stelly, I can tell you that we are last <clears throat> call in the sauce. Oh my goodness! I only have <clears throat> June 26th. And only 500 left. And you get two bottles. And once you open them, you want to pop them in the fridge because it is a, it is a mayonnaise based sauce. Creamy and tangy and oh, so delicious. <laughs> Don't miss out on this. Now, I will also tell you that we're getting very busy all over again with our today's special value. So many of you are saying, well, are these going to be packed individually? Yes. Can I cook them from frozen? It's recommended they be cooked from frozen. Now, sometimes we, we hear, well, yeah, you can cook them from frozen if you have to. No, we want you to cook these from frozen. Mr. Rostelli wants you to put these on a hot grill, rock hard frozen, because you're going to get best results that way. That's exactly right. And the reason you get best results is because this is ribeye, right? This is ribeye steak and chuck. And of course, when you, we fold that together, here's what happens. You can see that Rostelli burger on the left. It has been folded together instead of pressed. So it cooks from the inside out. You get beautiful moisture in there and it stays inside versus the traditional burger that cooks on the outside. Now, here's our burger. We drop it on the grill from frozen. At about four minute mark, you can see me dropping some seasoning right on top. Then I'm gonna flip that over. Please do not press that burger, right? Let it sit right on your grill. And this is what's gonna happen. You're gonna see it plump and that's why Everyone loves this burger. You've got to be careful when you eat it because it's so juicy, you're going to realize it may be running down both of your arms. It might be on your shirt. Yes, it might be yeah, on your shirt. It might just be. This is what it looks like. Everyone's individually frozen. They come in a box, a black label <clears throat> reserve Rostelli box, and they're perfect. Don't miss out on these burgers. Everybody is, is super excited about it. Rostelli Burgers are a 2022 Customer Choice Food Award winner. Mm -hmm. And you're going to love the fact that this is a fork tender burger. You see Mr. Rostelli cutting this with a knife, but you don't have to. You can actually cut this with a fork. And we're just at the beginning of summer grilling season. It's not even the official start of summer. Not yet. And price will expire end of day today. And already over 22,000 sets have been ordered. This is going to be your time to pick up your burgers. And we can do a set of 12 or 24, delivering it now or 626, and it will arrive before 4th of July. Mr. Rostelli, you happen to have some here with cheese uh, on it. You know we how do, I like David, it. I'm going to let you do that. And while you do that, I've taken this ribeye burger and I've cut it into a beautiful steak. And I want you to be able to see, you can cut it into a steak-like size because it is all ribeye and all chuck. It's not something that, it's not a mystery meat that we don't know what it's from. These are small family farms that I have worked with for over 40 years. That's important to me because as a butcher, 
I need to know where my food comes from. I need to know where that meat comes from because if I understand where it comes from, I can rest assured that my guests that walk into my butcher shop in every week are going to be as happy as my family is. And of oh. course, that Poppy's famous barbecue so uh, burger sauce, I should say, it's not just for your burger. You can put it on your salad. You can put it <laughs> on a sandwich. I love putting it on my french fries, actually, Dave. Very nice. Yes. All right, I'm going to have a little burger because I'm, I'm mm -hmm. getting weak in the knees. <laughs> mm. Mm. First of all, it's like a waterfall in your mouth. Yes. Super juicy. Really wonderful great beef flavor. Mmm. Melts on your tongue. And the only thing left to do is the happy dance. There it there is. It is. <laughs> Come on now. Everybody is loving these burgers, and I want you. Now, if you plan to serve it this way, let me highly recommend. Because this eats like a wonderful piece of steak. So if you want to do a brown gravy and mushrooms on top and make a Salisbury steak, beautiful. If you want to put this and add this to your buns, great. For me, I would probably uh, grill up a couple of these and eat them with a fork and a knife, just because it seems a little more elegant that way. <laughs> and add cheese and my favorite toppings to these. This is what's great about this. You can dress these up any way you like them, and everywhere you see juice, you see flavor. 22,700 now gone, and almost 7,000 now ordered in this show. Price will expire at end of day if it lasts that long. And it's important to know that this is going to be your chance to really stock your freezer with something great. I mean, imagine on a Tuesday night and everyone's like, let's have burgers for dinner. I'll fire up the grill. I'll cut up the tomato. Mm -hmm. And then you're like, but wait, I haven't thawed them. You don't need to. In fact, it's recommended that you don't. Put them on that hot grill frozen. Four minutes on one side and right before you flip it, hit with some of that Roselli seasoning. Then flip it and cook it for another four minutes. That's going to cook it to a medium, medium rare. If you want it cooked a little longer than that, then cook it a little longer than that. That's what it's all about. But it's going to retain all that juice and all that great flavor. Think, think of this on, on Father's Day, because they will get to you for Father's Day. So that's a wonderful, wonderful gift. And it comes in our beautiful black reserve box. So they're going to be thrilled when they get it, each one individually vacuum packed. But I want you to see the size of the burger. It's the largest burger that we have ever, ever created. It's for. a bun filler. It's a bun filler. And because it doesn't shrink, because it actually plumps when you cook it, um, it fills very, very fast. Now, uh, Mr. Rostelli, if you were to buy the 12 count, we're looking at about $5.83 per burger. If you go with the 24 count, it's $4.58 a burger. Now, you go to the drive through <laughs> and I know we don't like to admit it, but we do it. We go to the drive through and you did that. I did that. And you bought one of America's most popular selling burgers, and that burger is pitiful. I did. So I'm going to take it off the bun once I find it. Um, so I'm going to reach in, going to take it off the This This is that burger that so many millions of Americans have purchased. This is our burger. So I want you to see the comparison. And look at the thickness. Um, now, even if you ordered a double or a triple of that regular drive through burger, it's not going to be as thick as one Rostelli burger. No, it won't. And you know what? We really don't know what's in this burger, do we? We do know what's in this burger. This is mm. Black Angus Reserve. What does reserve mean? Well, reserve means that only 4% of all cattle in the entire country qualify for this. It's based on their marbling. It's based on their, their color, the age, actually, of that cattle. So 4% goes into this of just our beautiful ribeye trim and our chuck trim. And what happens is we take a product and age that for 45 days. So everyone says, what's aging? Well, aging is a natural process mm -hmm. of enzymes and proteins actually tussling. And that tussling makes it tender, makes it very, very tender. So when you have a really tender piece of meat and it's got the marbling of a ribeye and a chuck in it, you get the juices that you saw in this burger. And when you cook it on a grill, or you cook it in on the skillet, and I love doing it on a skillet, and you can use this all year round. Or a grill pan. Or a grill pan, you're gonna notice that it actually plumps. So please don't press that burger. You're gonna press all them incredible juices and flavors <laughs> out of it. So that's what I think is the most important thing, is I've got a burger it's a that summer I, I can, I'm going to be so proud to be able to have people over at Father's Day and, of course, on the 4th of July, and they look and they go, oh, my goodness, where'd that burger come from? Well, you're going to be able to say, well, it came from my butcher. Well, because, that's what you say. You say, did you see the name on the mailbox? Yes. <laughs> it came from Marcelli. Yeah. Hey, can I tell you, in the 12 count, in the immediate ship, we're now half gone for the day. Oh, goodness. In the 24 count for immediate ship, we're still good there, yes? All right, now, in mm. June 26th, arriving in time for 4th of July, in the 12 count, available, and the 24 count, also available. 
and we're more limited in the uh, in the ship wake of 626 all the way around. Auto delivery is every 60 days for a year. Now for the day, 23,500 for this show only. 7,500 sets of burgers. Um, hey, Big Bite, do you have an audience member who wants to try a burger? I do. I've got Pete here. Pete, where are you visiting us from today? Uh, Old Lyme, Connecticut. Oh, wonderful. Do you like burgers? Yes, I do. Do you like steak? Yes, I do. Well, you're in luck. How about we go down and build, a, build us a burger here? All right, let's hear it for Pete, everyone. We're going to go right this way. Oh, perfect timing. All right, and I hope you're hungry. Oh, yeah. Oh, perfect. Of course, we're going to feed you after the show, too, so save uh, one hollow leg. Yeah. Yes. Pete, it's good to welcome you in, sir. Nice, nice, to, nice to have you here. Pete, it's great to see you. I've started you at least with the burger, Excellent. but from there, we've got some tomatoes, some onions, some pickles, some What's your pleasure, some peppers. Sir? What would you like on I'm there? I'm going to do some tomato. Tomato, okay. Yep. We've got some of that for you. I'll do some lettuce. Okay. We're going to put some bib lettuce right on top there Very for nice. you. Some of, those, uh, some, some of those banana peppers. Perfect. Would you like to try any of the uh, Poppy's famous barbecue sauce? Or a burger sauce, I should say, sure, right on course. top? Okay. We're going to do that for you. A little bit of this. I can't say no. You can't. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thanks, thanks to my wife for getting me into this project. <laughs> <laughs> And where's your wife? Let's, let's swing right the cameras there. around. Right Hi, wife. What's your first name? <laughs> What's wife's first name? Mary. Mary. Hi, Mary. Hi, sweetheart. Well, Mary, now she's gonna. He, she's. He's really gonna be happy that you did this because he's gonna be able to take a bite of this. All right. <laughs> All right. Where do I let the droppings go? Right there. You. Right I'll there. catch them. How's there that? <laughs> we. Okay. That's a good big bite. <laughs> he knows big bites. That's a. Good... Oh, happy dance. <laughs> happy dance. <laughs> Fantastic. Peter does not uh, mess around. No, he does not. Doesn't wait to be cued. He just does it. Fantastic. Is that good stuff? Very good. Oh, we love awesome. that. Awesome. Thank you. Awesome. Wonderful. Thank you. Well, let's well, get, come with me. We'll you. get you a plate. Sure as now. We'll get you a plate. <laughs> good to meet you, sir. Pleasure. And tell Mary we said hi. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah. Okay. Hi, Mary. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Please use QVC.com or mobile apps. How are we doing on our uh, Poppy's burger sauce? Oh, it's gone. Well, oh. I'm going to leave one bottle here for you to play with. Okay, so we'll do that. Way. All right. Hey, let's grab these. And, oh, oh, hello. How you doing? You were like perfect because. I like one of those little sliders. I, I'm so. Let me show you what I did here. It's yeah. so simple. Because remember, these are huge burgers, right? They're five. And while y'all do that, I'm just going to have some. Of this. There you go. Yeah. For product control. <laughs> for product uh, research purposes. What I did was I took a burger and I flattened it out and I made it a little square. So for this, I had to thaw it actually. But then what I did is I grilled it and I put it on top of these buns. Now. I'm just going to take my pickles and I'm going to put four pickles down there. Some cheese. Yeah, going to some cheese on there too. We can certainly put some cheese on there as well. Um, and how about if we give you a little bit of that sauce? Because yes. I know you loved it when you tasted it. Yes. So we're going to so just good. do just a little, just a little dribble on each mm -hmm. one of them. But remember, this is one burger, right? And this I do for my grandkids because they're they're small, right? Put that Such top a good idea. right back on. Uh, let's take some two. Of course, you know, Ro has an almost two-year-old at home. Mm -hmm. This is going to be perfect. Ro. Yes. Um, but I want you to see one burger. This is one of those beautiful 5.33 ounce Angus ribeye burgers. That's nice. Cut into sliders. Cut into Fantastic. sliders. It's a great and idea. Way to get taste it, Ro. An appetizer or for anybody. I mean, I love sliders. I can have maybe a few, right? But yep. Well, that, that's it, you know, and it's not just for kids because there you go. Thank because you. if you're going to a barbecue or you're going to a cookout, maybe you've got some chicken, maybe you've got some of Corky's ribs on there. Mm. You know, what's really mm. wonderful is now this is just a smaller bite, but right, how good is that? It is so <clears throat> juicy and tender. But that poppy sauce just really, whoa, mama. <laughs> I'm so glad you all got that, um, and hopefully you got it before it's gone. And Mr. Rostelli, you're going to have to make more of that. We you certainly will be doing all that. Right. Yes, yes. Please. These are going very quickly. In fact, now we've taken orders for 24,500. That means in this show, 8,500 in this show. Wow. Now, in the 12 count immediate, we're well over half gone for the day. We also have the 24 count immediate ship. We can do 626, which will arrive before 4th of July in a 12 count or a 24 count. And you may do a stock up and save. If you go with that 24 count, you're saving almost $30 on the stock up and save. Plus, we have auto delivery every 60 days for a year. So if you decide you want to keep a good thing coming, and yeah. you will, yes. this is going to be perfect. Don't let the summer creep up on you because it's already hot outside. Mm -hmm. It's already grilling season outside. Of 
Everybody has already started probably grilling over Memorial Day weekend, right? So this is what it's all about. Make sure you're stocked and ready for all 